Hey everybody, it's Crafty Kitty. I'm here to share with you a haul that I got and I'm just going to move you forward because it's a little bit um, weird. Okay, okay. Let's try that. All right, so I got a haul for you from a bunch of stores, uh, Dollar Tree, Dollarama, um, from the thrift store. Excuse my voice, I got a really I think I got a cold, but it's hard to tell. It could be my allergies are acting up as well. So I'm going to start with the thrift store stuff, and we'll see how long it takes. I might do it in two videos. Um, I also have one video I'm, a video I'm going to do after. I received some really nice mail from one of the YouTube channels that I'm subscribed to. I've actually won one of her giveaways. So um, I'm going to save that, and I'll do that in its own video. So let's get started, and uh, I'll show you the first couple of things that I found in the thrift store. So we all know I like clocks. So this I found, this awesome looking clock. It was uh, $9.99, but I had a 30% off coupon, and um, it only cost me uh, $6.99 instead, so I thought that was a pretty good deal. It is from HomeSense originally. It was $24.99. So for six bucks, six, seven dollars, not bad. I like it. I like clocks, so I'm just gonna keep adjusting you until I can think this is gonna work. So you don't only really see my head, but I guess that's all that's gonna be happening here because something's not right. I think every time I adjust this, it sort of falls over. So hopefully this does not fall over anymore. <laughs> um, I got little bags as well. I got this one because I really like it. It was only $1.99. And again, I got 30% off of all of these, so not bad. But I really bought it just for this little guy for a springtime uh, idea. Also came with these. They are, um, well, they're called Christmas Street, but they look like they're hanging baubles, basically. And apparently we're $8.99 to begin with. So not bad. Then there are there was this, which is really random. <laughs> one test tube, which I think I can handle and I'll put over there. There was some clings as well. This is Happy St. Pat's Day with uh, I don't know why there's an Easter decoration in here, but oh well. I'll probably just redonate that because I don't have any use for it. Um, the other thing I found was this whole whack of stickers and stuff for $2.99. So I thought I would pick it up and see what was inside. Because some of these things are a lot worth a lot more than $2.99. Well, these are cute. Little Halloween stickers. I don't know I can put those to good use. Um, I guess there's some stickers that have been used. They're probably from the same pack, so pretty cute. I like them. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, they have been used, some of them. So these ones are just like little puffy stickers with words. Hmm. Not bad. I think my light keeps cutting out. And then there's these ones. With her baby ones, it says, oops, look what I did. Tub time, I need a nap, and I need it now. That's been me for the last couple of days, actually, to tell you the truth. Um, from Creative Imaginations, it is birthdays uh, for one-year-olds, which will come in handy because I have, you know, pictures I still haven't done things with from my children's scrapbook pages. Oh, this is so cool. The soul is healed by being with children. Unless they're teenagers and they're driving you nuts at this time. <laughs> but this one is so true. They are only little for so long. So if you have a new little ones or little ones in your family, enjoy them. And um, I love this one. It says, grown-ups never understand anything for themselves. And it is tiresome for children to always be and forever explaining things to them. <laughs> I have to say, I really like this one. Um, this really cracks me up. Uh, 
Yeah, definitely awesome. Getting caught is the mother of invention. Yeah, and the other one. Will you play with me? Remember, playing with your kids is a lot of fun. Oh, there's a... This looks like it comes from Hobby Lobby. That's pretty cool. And I found it up in Canada. Uh, Stickopotamus. And it's like holographic Halloween ones. <clears throat> pretty cool. Oh, we got some nice leaves. These are all... Oh, okay. So we got another thing of leaves. Some flowers. This one's very pretty. This is me and my big ideas. Oh, it's for mums. Mother's Day. Wow. And I know in um, Michael's, this stickers alone are usually um, close to $7. So our Michael's are really expensive. Oh, here we got Recollections one, too, for Halloween. Wow. I need to hit the jackpot on those things. Oh, Creative Imaginations. This is pretty cool. There's two sheets of this. It's just uh, alphabets. That is awesome. And I'm not sure which set it goes to. Crazy, but it usually matches. Oh, this is pretty from K and Company for babies. Oh, so cute. Well, definitely got it. Got the jackpot for this for $2.99. Like, holy free holy. Oh, uh, nice alphabet stickers. Oh, and there's one for dads too, from like the creative, uh, me and my big ideas. Wow, those are awesome. <laughs> definitely, my parents are exhausted. That was definitely us some days. My boys are only 13 months apart. So yeah, we were a little bit exhausted. <laughs> And then we have this, which is for the first haircut. That is so cool. I always remember my husband, my son was, my son Max was beautiful blonde hair, little baby with gorgeous, gorgeous curls. And um, he was about one and a half because our, no, one in three months basically, because our little one was just um, maybe three months old or something. Anyways, he went out with him one day and he had been wearing a little suit and this lady comes up to him and says, oh, your little girl is so cute. And my husband was like, it's a boy and his name's Max. And she's like, oh, he's so cute with those beautiful curls. And I was like, you know, to me, that didn't make any difference because he just looks like my baby and he had blonde, blonde, blonde hair and blue and dark brown eyes and just the most curliest blonde hair ever. And I guess right after that happened, my husband took him into the hair salon and cut all his curls off. Yes, no discussion with me whatsoever. But uh, he retold me the story about what the um, the hairdresser told him. He's like, she asked him, she goes, does your wife know you're doing this? And he's like, well, no, she doesn't have to. And she's like, are you sure? And he's like, well, it's okay. We're just cutting his hair. It's not a big deal. She's like, okay. So she cut his hair and then she picked up all the curls. She cut all the curls before they hit the ground so that they didn't get mixed up with anybody else's hair. And she put them in a baggie. And she told my husband, she says, here, you want to take this baggie home with you? And he's like, what for? And he, she's like, trust me, you'll want to take this baggie home with you. She goes, you'll see. So he walks through the door and the first thing I saw was my son. And I was like, oh. You cut all his curls off. Oh my God. He just stood there and he went like this. He goes, I have the baggie. <laughs> and I was like, he doesn't look like a baby anymore. He looks like a little boy. What did you do? She's, he's like, some girl, th some woman thought he was a girl. I had to make him into a boy. And I was like, Ur. he's like, but I have the baggie. And I was like, yeah, you're lucky. <laughs> Give me those. I take the curls and of course put them away so that I have a, you know, the little momentum of his first haircut. But oh, he was lucky, very very lucky. He brought those curls home. But anyways, I digress. But <laughs> definitely have this for that, <laughs> all that story for that sticker. That's very nice. <laughs> um, I found this as well for dollar ninety nine. It is from Dollarama. It was actually I think three dollars in Dollarama. But it is, 
It looks like it's never been used and I never was able to find this one. It is a chalkboard banner. So that was a good buy as well. Um, another bag. It's $1.99 as well. Now this one I think sort of speaks for itself. I bought it because of these. Like these at the dollar store or $1.25 at the Dollar Tree. But they don't have these little ones like this. So I mean, I'm thinking this came from Michael's. The other thing it had was this, which I'm not that keen on, but it's okay. Also had snow cone cups, which I don't need. They had little baggies for Christmas treats. <clears throat> and I, I don't have, oh, these are wine charms, okay. They're like little bobblehead charms. <laughs> I only originally bought this because I wanted the um, the styrofoam thing. So the rest of it might just go back to the... Sorry. Got a bit of itchy eye. Allergies. Um, might go back to the store. So I'll just redonate it. But I really wanted the foam trees. Um, the other things I found were... I have one more bag full of stickers. And it was $1.99. I think I might end up having to do two videos because I don't want them to be overly long. So we have this one. It's a little been used a bit. As a thermometer and, and the stethoscope. And little pills, prescriptions, needle. Has this one in it for a nurse. It has this for grad. And I guess from the dollar store, it probably has these little guitars. Not bad. I can think I've used for those. So that was all this crafty stuff. I'm going to show you what I found also. Now these are from uh, Ikea, and I found them. And they were $2.99 for two. So... And it's just these. It's pillowcase. Um, pillowcases. So I bought those two. And there was actually, I was really astonished with the fact that there was actually two more. So for $6. And I looked these up online. And these things were, I believe it was $14.99 for the pillowcase. Not even including a pillow. So I think it scored pretty good on those. And then I happened to find... This one, these two as well. Um, I'm just checking to make sure where their tag was. No, no tag. No, oh, wait there. No, that's not it. Sorry, I'm just looking because I can't remember. No, these ones are not from Ikea. But I thought they matched really nicely. See? has a beautiful thing in here and I plan on painting my living room while well, getting rid of the accent wall of green but I thought it would match this really nicely I have and I have these really beautiful um, curtains that I bought from the value village a while ago that were from Pier 1 and I think they'll all tie in together very well and just give me a new look my New Year's resolution this year is to try and get my craft room and everything else in my house and organized. Um, I'm not going to be doing a lot of haul videos anymore uh, because I have too much stuff. I need to get rid of a lot of stuff. I need to purge, uh, especially for things that I didn't actually get around to doing. So chances are I probably won't get around to doing it. So I might as well just get rid of the stuff and just start with a clean slate. So anyways... I hope you liked this video. If you do, please give me a thumbs up. Uh, give me one second, please. Sorry about that. I had to sneeze and I really didn't want to do it on camera. <laughs> but anyways, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel already, please do so. Um, if you're looking for some very interesting channels to watch, go ahead and check out my subscriber list. Uh, all the channels that I'm subscribed to will populate there. Um, I don't know if they show all the channels you're subscribed to or if it does or not. It's hard to say because I am subscribed to 
everybody who subscribes to me. So, but if you want to find some great channels, I'm telling you, I am subscribed to some pretty awesome channels and you should go check them out. So thanks for watching and let's all get crafty. Bye-bye.